Hello everybody. I will be demonstrating to you how to inspect and clean harsh environment connectors. We can see them here on the board. We have the HE2000 connect and bulkhead. We have the MIL3899 also connect and bulkhead. And we have the MIL83526 connect and bulkhead. We all know that uh, network failure is mainly due to contaminated end faces of the two ferrules. What we advise is the complete kit which contains the microscope, contains the inspection probe, the 5000i and uh, uh, all the accessories. I will now show you how to inspect and eventually clean uh, bulkhead 3899 or connector. Uh, the same method would be for the A3526 and for the HE2000 connector. Uh, regarding the HE2000 bulkhead, it needs more attention and I will show you in the second step. We will now inspect the end face of the ferrules. What I've done is I've connected my P5000E to the microscope. I've uh, connected the new long reach of the new generation. There is the cap fitting, which is used for inspecting ferrules without the hollow pin guide. The hollow pin guide, I take out the cap fitting and then I can check it. Huh? So let's start off by uh, we can now just check a PC connector. This goes inside like that. I focus it and I have a magnification of a hundred times here. If I press the button, I have magnification 200 times. That is the fiber. Uh, now I will go to the four degree power solution and you can see I can I can inspect the four degrees as well. I will now remove the cap fitting and go to the eight degrees with a hollow pin guide. And there you can see I can inspect the end face as well, huh? Okay. We will simulate we're in the field, we have a 3 8 line bulkhead and we have a problem with two channels. I will now start by inspecting. I will inspect the ferrule without the hollow pin guide and I can see on the microscope already that it's full of dirt. Huh? So I will now try to clean the end face of the ferrule, I have the IBC 2.5 millimeter. Uh, just take note that that has been uh, reworked from diamond in order that it fits in the DM4 insert. Huh? So there you are, one to two. And I will now check it. And I can see it looks pretty good. Huh? The fiber as well okay so this channel is okay i will now continue with the other one this one had no problem but i will check it anyway it looks okay and now i remove the cap fitting and i will check the other two this one looks pretty good huh? and let's check oh there's some liquid inside. Let me just get a bit of focus. Okay. So I've got to get this cleaned up. Huh? So what I do now is I remove the cap fitting because I have to go inside the hollow pin guide and clean it. Huh? I will now check it. 
and wow that looks very good huh okay just you gotta play around until you find the best image huh? okay that looks good I will now demonstrate how to inspect the end faces of the ferrules of the HE2000 bulkhead. So what we need is a clip to hold down my inner spring and the tools I need are exactly the same as the other ones. I will now inspect the two ferrules without the hollow pin guide. Huh? So. I will go down. I know this is a uh, four degrees high power, and that looks that looks good. Let me just find the focus. There you are. Okay. Now I'll go to the other side, and I will inspect. I have a zero degrees PC. This is completely contaminated, and it needs cleaning. Huh? Before I do that, I will now remove the cap fitting and go and inspect the other two with a hollow pin guide. This is now a uh, this is now a APC. Let me just focus it. Huh? Okay, there you go. Looks very very good. And the other one, which is a PC. Okay, there you are. See the whole contact area is very clean and the fiber as well, huh? Okay. Now to clean it, we will use uh, the cap fitting because it's the top right side it was the dirty one, and there we go. Then I'll give it a check. Let's put the tip on again and there we go. Oh, looks very good, huh? Thank you. What you can do as well is you can connect the P5000E to a PC. You have to, of course, first download uh, the program Fiber Check Pro and then uh, use it as we used it on the uh, standard microscope. Huh? Now I will be checking this connector, which is an APC. And there you can see the quality of the image is good, or let's say very good. You can, uh, you can however, go in setup and correct the illumination, increase it or decrease it. You can save your images, but that is also valid for the OLP82 uh, microscope. You can save the images and then download it on the PC. Thank you.